Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com, and today we're gonna do a quick comparison between the Nexus 5 running the Dalvik runtime, which is what it normally has, and uh, comparing it against itself running the Art runtime, which is the new one made by Google just now. Um, if you don't know how to set this up, you can click on the link beneath this video on our site to be taken to how to set up uh, the Art runtime. Um, and in this video, we're just gonna kind of compare the two devices together um, and see if there is a big difference when opening apps uh, in terms of speed. The first thing we're gonna do is a boot up test just to see if this affects the uh, speed of the device booting up. Uh, so far, it looks like they're pretty much neck and neck. Um, the Android device on the left is the Nexus 5 running JIT, and the Android device on the right is also the Nexus 5, the exact same phone, by the way, uh, running the Art runtime. And it seems like the Art device is about three seconds faster booting up. Next up, we have the video game test. So we're gonna load the same game on both, which is Temple Run 2, um, and see which one loads faster again. Seems about the same. Next, we'll open a web page. This shouldn't really be affected by it, but just in case, we're gonna check it out. And again, seems like it's the same. Next, we'll open some apps to see how they respond. Facebook is first. Um, seems that Facebook is opened up differently on Art than it is on JIT, so the JIT one comes a little quicker. Um, then Spotify, which it seems the Art loaded just a hair faster. Um, and moving around the menu seems a little quicker on Art. YouTube, about the same. And navigating menus, a little quicker on art. Instagram, loading up about the same. And even opening the camera about the same. Next up is Gmail. And it seems going through some of the inboxes is quicker on the art device. Next we'll do Google Maps. And it seems pretty much the same maybe a little smoother um, on art. Twitter loads up quicker on art, even just loading in general. Um, and then there's a little bit more of a difference noticeable using the Twitter app there as well. Okay, so there you have it. Uh, these are all the apps we're gonna compare, just kind of give you a quick real world scenario. Um, I have to say though that just using the device on a daily basis, it does seem a little snappier when it's on art, um, even though some of those didn't seem that way. Uh, but let us know what you guys think. See if you're experiencing the same uh, and leave them in the comments underneath this video. And there you go. Enjoy.